I am struck, Dr. Sportelli, by Jennifer's account that hairdressers were handing them out, <laughs> managers handing them out, but because they come in a bottle with a prescription or a doctor's name on it, everyone feels like this is no big deal. And I guess I can understand why it's more pervasive in the entertainment industry um, or any field similar to that. Is there a reason why these fields in particular are, are rampant with abuse? Yeah, yeah, so think about it, guys. Adderall and stimulants, they're meant for people that have a deficit, right? Attention deficit. So there's, there's people that have a problem with attention and focus, and it brings them to a baseline, right? But when you take the entire culture and you change that baseline, all of a sudden the cultural baseline is, I need to be on 24 seven. So all of a sudden we've taken that baseline and reset it. Yeah. And now people think it's normal to take these stimulants, central nervous system stimulants, to get to that point. And that's not what they're intended for. It's incredibly unsafe to do that. And then what you're doing by doing that is you're creating this perpetuated cycle of abuse and dependence. You know, the, the, the first time I ever went in front of the camera, what everyone came up to me and said, I was just an ER doctor. ERs are chaotic, right? But what they said was, hey, if your normal life is here, the minute that camera comes on you, take it to here. Yeah. You're like, well, what does that mean? <laughs> and you know, no. the first few times you're like, you start screaming. <laughs> yeah, hey, well, I'm, I'm like, and, and you're right, it's up here and, and every time it's bigger, it's gotta, the camera dampens everything. Sure. And so I, I can't imagine that kind of pressure when people are, you know, handing pills to you. I, I was uh, completely unaware that this, this, poten this could have taken your life. You were in that dark of a place. I mean, it, I was seconds, moments and seconds away from dying. And um, to see that and to know that this is happening every single day, not just in Hollywood, but all over our country, um, it's devastating, you know? And if I could tell you the names of beautiful faces and beautiful talents that I've literally seen die, you know, um, and that are dying right now, slowly dying because they're on Adderall, or other drugs because, you know, we need to fit that mold, you know, and it's like you're in a race against this person and that person. And when you realize, you know, what my gift, I'm so grateful to say is I was, you know, I thought I was in a race with that person or that person. The race is against me within myself, mm -hmm. you know. It's not about anyone else. And there's more room out there for everyone to have their space and to have their moments as well.